we'll be taking a look at a controversy that took place one year ago, but is resurfacing as Sonic 93 decides she wants to put a close to it. Something's up. Something's not right. This all goes deeper. And I'm gonna get to the bottom of it. They're giving out free stuff in there! G'day, mates! My name is Ethan 2 and it's time to give proper evidence! It's Professor Ethan 2, PhD, and Dr. Evidence. I feel I'm so smart, rude. Now, for this video, I know people are gonna be expecting a few things, but I got my script here because I don't want to go in there blindly. And I got my home brand Kalora because I think I'm gonna need this during the recording. <laughs> oh boy. Okay, what's going on here? Let's see. For a quick recap on today's subject before we get into it. Sonny 93 started bringing up old drama. She made two videos which are heavily disliked and well deservedly of course and still to this day gay keeps silver the porcupine and for this we are not covering sonic 93 actually no we're going to be covering her white knights by the name of alexander's average voice i know his name is worldly voice but his voice is kind of average you'll see why during the second the video is now deleted but thank you watson the lovely bill b which is possibly what i'm going to call my anonymous sources found the video and sent it to me thank you so much watson you're the best so i don't know what to expect I still got a script down here, and let's see how this guy's evidence is so unbelievable than Christianity. And me being a Christian saying that, I can understand the hypocrisy on this. Hey everybody, it's Alexander. Okay, we're not even 10 seconds into the video, and I'm already bored! There's not much excitement, and plus your microphone kind of cracks a bit. I don't know if my microphone is cracking a bit, just point that out in the comments if this ever gets uploaded. But, oh my goodness, this... I know, you're using your laptop microphone, you're probably using your computer, or you're just in the lounge room while your family and friends are watching by, and you had headphones on. But we can hear a lot of background noises during your recording. And what's even more irritating to me, that your recording is so... I'm not just sleep bad. I know. It's weird. I'm using my iPad to record my videos. But this is just straight up Badsville. What's the matter with editing? You haven't edited your video. You just you record your video and you don't get a program to edit it. Please, future future YouTubers. Edit your videos. I am more than willing to give you a chance to edit a video before you upload it. Please. And today, we'll be taking a look at a controversy that took place one year ago, but is resurfacing as Sonic 93 decides she wants to put a close to it. Um, from what I've read, she is not putting it to a close, she is bringing it back up. Says by none other than just a robot, who I'm also gonna be saying some part of this video. You can call me a just a robot white knight because I'm defending him, but just a robot is in the right to make a video, and he does sound more logical than what Alex makes himself out to be. You'll find that out during this video. Which I mean, that's totally okay, you know? Now, before we get into Just a Robot's video, which has a shocking like-to-dislike ratio. Okay, during this pod and onwards, 
I'm gonna try my best to edit out his long pauses because it's so ear grating to me. You know what? When I'm recording this video, I'm gonna take a shot of this home brand Kalora. Yep, that's Kalora. And I feel good already. Based on the actual contents of the video. Uh, I just want to take notice of something. On part one of of her uh, of her talking about the dang it, I can't speak today. I swear. Sorry for being mean, but get a script. I got one for this video. Get a proper script, or at least practice your lines before you even say something. Because when you're doing it off the top of your head, that's not that's not gonna make really good content. You at least need to, one, edit, two, know what you're going to say before you start recording, and three, jot down points! Even though you're just saying things out of your mouth, at least have the bright idea of what you're going to say. And so far, you're boring us. Edit, please! I'm begging you from the bottom of my heart edit your videos please you know what i'm gonna take another shot at this because okay on part one of her talking about this controversy look at the like to dislike ratio it's 186 to 79 Ooh, nobody gives a shit with 7,000 views now, then she made part two next. Totally fair. Uh, yeah, if you made a part one, at least you can make a part two. Do, does it not click to you that if you make a part one, you should not make a part two? I'm pretty concerned. And this is coming from the guy whose video title is Just a Robot Video on Sonic 93 is bitter dishonest trash which is pretty hypocritical but we'll get to that in a moment and then this response came out like immediately after it got more views than that first one did which is kind of sad now look at the like to dislike ratio here 700 to 11 but look at the like to dislike ratio for part two of this 115 likes to 403 dislikes. So essentially part one and part two of this rant, which are basically talking about the same thing, the like to dislike ratio for them is shockingly different. Which basically means that Wild Paws here sent his fans over to attack her. Oh, my favorite! No, 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 no! If you actually seen Wild Paws' video, first of all, that person you're talking about is a she. You can tell by the voice, unless she's a trans. You can tell by the hair from any of her thumbnails, and two, her voice. She's definitely a girl, which also means you haven't seen the video because not long after you start the video, she says, don't go attack anybody in this video. Also, and this shouldn't have to be said, but don't go out and harass Alduin, Sonic93, or anybody shown or mentioned in this video. If you do, you're an asshole. You lied. And you called just the robot this honest trash. You're the most dishonest person by far in this video, and we haven't gotten to the subject yet. I tell you, there are some funny things in the world, right? I'm sure that's just totally sheer coincidence. Now, this video got no backlash at all, but I I just thought it deserved some, you know? You know what? I'm going to be taking more than just a sip out of this. Now. You told people go attack just the robot because his video doesn't deserve as much backlash you know how
how hypocritical you sound right now, Alex. You said Wild Paws went to her fan base and tells them to attack Sonic 93, which she didn't if you have seen the video, which you didn't. And now you're telling people to go attack Just a Robot, even though you don't directly say it. You're still implying that he does deserve backlash. I can't fathom this sort of behavior. I am somewhat for and against cancel culture. There's a few people I think deserve to be canceled, like Onision, Timos Balls. But you cannot randomly say this person deserves backlash if they don't do anything wrong. Just a robot is a commentator. I've seen his videos. They're not mean, they were mostly mean spirited in a way that is to me is good background noise. You're implying that Just the Robot should be hated and be kicked off of YouTube because, oh, he hurts one of your idol's feelings. So fucking what? Ja has the right of freedom of speech. And so far for most of the commentators I subscribe to, they at least show proper evidence and most of the time are right about most cases. I'm not sure if I'm right, you can correct me if I'm wrong here. And you cannot say you have the right to tell people to go after somebody. That is just low. Sonic 93 had told a few <coughs> She told a few people to go attack a minor on DeviantArt. And she doesn't deserve that much of backlash. Personally, I think Sonic needs to be knocked down a peg. Well, I understand you're a low subscribing channel, but please do not tell people to go attack somebody because, oh, they hurt somebody's feelings. Understand what they're presenting. Do not just think randomly out of your mouth. Never do that! So I will be criticizing. Uh, my friend Cody actually gave me some notes just on some things that I might not already know about the video, so I'll go get them. Oh, um, Cody, that may explain about your lack of attitude because you and BF made the script. I made my own script out of pencil, but yet I can still read my handwriting. Reason why I keep showing my script because it's so important, even when you're doing it off the top of your head, you at least need something to prove your point. You cannot just make, you cannot just rely on a script that your friend has made. They could be wrong as well. And for that, cheers to my buddies. Right. Let's see what he's got to say through App Jaws video. And he better not show any later clips of Sonic 93. I may jinx it. Who knows? I'm back. Oh, uh, really? You're gone? Where did you go to? Your safe space? Now let's get into it. Make apology videos before, and most of the time I've seen. People are even questioning it if they're sincere about it, you know? Hey, everybody, guess what? Sonic 93 did an oopsie. Just a robot. Whenever I have the chance to talk about the Deviant Art ranting community, I always take it, whether it's Icy Hazard or Stories in Pentagram. But Sonic. Now, this isn't really related to the topic, so let's just skip all that. So, why did you. Why did you play the part in the video? So, why skip that part when it's not important? But then out of nowhere, Sonic 93 came back with another rant, and it was terrible. In the video, she covered another person's video and a DeviantArt journal. 
Both of them had a few complaints about Silver and Sonic 93 being a big Silver fan got her panties in a twist. Uh, for one of them, it was not just that they were complaining about Silver, but it was that they were complaining about Silver while also saying that they were a fan of Silver. And Sonic 93 thought that that was really hypocritical, so she called it out. And there's nothing wrong with that, despite what Jar is phrasing it to make you believe. Um, you know you can be a fan of something and have a problem with it. Like, for best example, I love Pokemon. And of course, my favorite Pokemon is right here. This is Zorok. Even though... It's my favorite character out of the whole entire franchise. I still have a few problems with this Pokemon. Like for best example, although its ability illusion was cool in film and TV, but in game wise, it does play an important role and even help you win certain battles with trainers. It's still kind of hard to pretty much picture a dark type able to go across most of the Pokemon in the game. A great Pokemon and he is, I still have a few problems with him when it comes to certain trainers. Jinka did a commentary on Sonic 93 and Sonic 93 took her video down and now yeah, she took her video down because she thought that she was being attacked for the contents of it. And based on what we saw a second ago, with someone else having responded to her most recent video, and then it getting spammed with dislikes, it's not too unlikely. Not too unlikely, Jar. Or, Sonic 93 doesn't know how to defend herself, so she took the video down. You ever thought of that? I felt I was really worked up by it, not because it was different opinions from mine. No, of course not. Everyone is entitled to their own opinions, obviously. Oh, you weren't worked up by it because it was different opinions? Well, let's check out a clip from your original video. Oh my god! What the fuck is wrong with you? Seriously! You have a different. Oh my god. What? Hold on. There was, like, no context to that. Like, that was the most out-of-context two-second video clip from what was potentially, like, 10 or 20 minutes. I don't know. I don't know how long Sonic 93 uploads for on average, but there's no way that the actual context of that quote was in there. And neither does a bunch of people. And secondly, it's not out-of-context. She's still calling people out and saying, what the fuck is wrong with you, seriously? And she degraded a minor. You think that is okay when Sonic 93 did that? And I'm not going to show you the rest of the clips that is from that and onwards until we get to the next slide. Because he shows a clip of Sonic 93's later video and just confirming what Jar was saying. That is the weakest evidence I have ever seen. When you're displaying evidence, be sure it's displaying proper motive. Do not just show a clip and say, Well, this proved my point. It shows that you don't know what you're talking about. If I understand your voice, you're probably a teenager. So, I can't fault you for thinking that. But, you possibly need to be schooled a bit. You still proven Jaws points while showing that clip because Donnie 93's point of view hasn't changed. It's still in context of what Jar is saying and proving what has been said, but you take it off of him lying and being hypocritical. I'm confused at this point. I think I need more alcohol after this. Wow. Okay. Thanks. 
Sorry. Uh, sorry to say, Jar, but that's actually pretty good context. <laughs> oh, was that meant to be a gotcha moment? This is my gotcha moment. I get it. I don't get it. Oh, wait, this was another thing that Cody, um, wrote to me about. When Jar brings up the shipping thing, which is what I assume that was, uh, go to, uh, Adyajinka is the real hypocrite. Yeah, and he played another clip once again, proving Jar's points. Is this supposed to be a troll video? Because I feel like this is a troll video at this point. You're trying to say Johnny93 is in the right, while John at the time is in the wrong, and you calling him hypocritical? I don't know if I'm hearing this correctly, or I'm just going deaf, but you're obviously not right in the head when you're not providing proper evidence and proving somebody else's evidence that you don't know what you're talking about! Jaws point still stands after you provided the evidence. But the evidence is not proper evidence. All you do is just displaying clips that your friend wrote to you and say, this is evidence, when it's obviously not. Okay, that's, uh, that's not too bad. So, Jar has lied about everything so far. Nice. No, he didn't, but you did throughout the fucking video! You lie to people that somebody went after Sonic 93. You lied about someone's gender, and you then told people to go attack Jar. How much of a fucking saint are you to the point that you have to go out of your way and attack somebody because they said something mean to somebody you like? You know what? Sit in the corner and see if I care. You know, I often title my videos, Blank Doesn't Understand Blank, but she's literally saying it. But again, as I said before, did you not watch out? Yeah, is there something wrong with that? Uh, hey, uh, someone made a response video to you, and you don't understand the points they're making. Well, that's entirely your fault, because you lack interpretation skills or something. So do fucking you. You haven't provide proper evidence, and yet you're saying John didn't provide evidence, even though he was being cool-headed and at least right in his video. Okay, what do we learn today, class? Oh, drunkness, where have you been? <laughs> okay, I'm gonna end this video here, and to those who are watching, Here's what you do when you try to provide evidence. One, be sure it's clear not just to you, but to everyone else. Two, be sure that it does feel in the context that you're putting it in. And three, write a script. If it doesn't sound right to you or the evidence doesn't provide whatever you're presenting, at least make it more presentable and wait till you get proper evidence, and not just go out of the horse's mouth. Okay, just don't go witch hunting this guy. I believe he's just a teenager who doesn't know what he's talking about. He's just ignorant. That's all I'm going to say. He's young, ignorant, and he's trying to protect somebody for the sake of because somebody. Anything else to boot? Just understand, don't go attack anybody, and be sure you're safe. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you all next time. Stay under your 50, my friends. All right, everyone. He said it. We can go home now. Gift bags at the door.